All right, now that we've got our garlic cloves all peeled and ready to go, I'm going to show you how these are going to be used in our prime rib. So all you want to do, you want cap, fat cap size side up because all the drippings will go down and sort of base the prime rib itself. The other side doesn't have this on here. So what you want to do is get a sharp knife and you don't have to go very deep with this, just enough for the clove of garlic to go in. So you can pull that across. I'd like to put about two and as you can see uh, this has been tied together. The butcher did this for me. You can do it yourself if you've got the technique down, but I find it just as easy. It doesn't cost anything extra for the butcher to do this for you. So just go ahead and put a couple of slits in each little area. You can do more if you'd like. I think this just gives the right amount of flavor because we are going to be using the garlic powder also. And the prime rib itself tastes so delicious that you don't want to overpower it with seasonings. Just go ahead and like that and just grab a clove of garlic. This is a big one. So you just want to kind of push it right on down into there. Going to seal it up. You want to make sure it goes down in there pretty far because you don't want this to burn during the roasting process. So just fill up all of those areas like that.